On your mark. Get set. Go! I've been a fan of Nickelodeon since I was a small child. From classic cartoons like Cat Dog and SpongeBob to sitcoms like Keenan and Kel, Nickelodeon was some of my favorite kids programming. I... <laughs> Drop the screw and the tuna! It was me! All the humanity! <laughs> but few programs stuck out to me quite like Double Dare. The Mark Summers hosted game show was a revelation, combining standard question and answer segments with outrageous obstacle courses. As a child of the 90s, the green slime, cream pies, and Apple computer prizes had me captivated. I always wanted to compete, but sadly, like the majority of people watching this video, I never got a chance to show Mark Summers what I was made of. Until now. Nickelodeon is relaunching Double Dare in 2018. YouTube sensation Liza Vakoshi will serve as the new host, and Mark Summers will provide color commentary. As a way to promote the show, they invited select members of the press to interview the hosts, and then participate in the classic Double Dare competition, complete with the famed obstacle course. If Nickelodeon's intention was for a fun, light-hearted afternoon, they clearly shouldn't have invited me. This was more than a chance to live out a childhood fantasy. This was a chance to make a name for myself and for our website, and for my family. The competition started with my team, Red Hot, competing against a Double Dare powerhouse, the Blueberries. First order of business, trivia. Naturally, Red Hot crushed it. On Nickelodeon's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, how many turtles make up the turtle team? Five seconds. Four. How many? Four. That's it, you got it, 20 more points. <laughs> We knocked questions out of the park with ruthless efficiency, but our opponents weren't slouches. Fair play, you guys picked up the points. Uh, Jojo Siwa, she's best known for wearing what in her hair? Bows. Bows is right. Wow. We traded blows until our destiny came into focus. The legendary double physical challenge. Musical chairs with cream pies. A diabolical twist on the classic that only the minds at Nickelodeon could conjure. One by one, members of Red Hot and Blueberries were picked off. You're gonna go and then all the way around the world, all right? On three, Ready. one, two, three, bang the pie! Until it was only me and my new rival, Dana, a wonder kid destined for greatness. Years of practice meant nothing as my moves were no match for Dana's quick hands. Just don't get dizzy. You ready? On your mark, get set, go! <laughs> the loser's punishment? A whipped cream pie to the face. Only you know what it's going to be, right here, on three. One, two, three, Thank you. Down but not out, I had to get ready for the final event, the obstacle course. But not without giving my arch rival some credit. Whipped cream everywhere, ear, nose, mouth, eyes. Yeah, Dana um, was really impressed with her. You know, her, her pie throwing speed and accuracy was uh, second to none. Uh, well, that's why she's the champion. Yeah. And I'm a loser. My team divided into groups for the crown jewel of Double Dare. After preparations and deliberations, we were off.
Very difficult. It's a lot harder than it looks, right? Yep. So all those years you were watching on TV and you're like, what are those kids doing? It's hard. It's a new appreciation. And here's the thing, on the show... We completed the event at a blistering pace, like I knew we would. All that was left was waiting for our clever opponents to compete. They were good, but I liked our chances. Dana, on your mark, get set, go! In a shocking twist, the war machine that is blueberries won, crushing my dreams in the process. Their prize? A frothy green bath of world famous Nickelodeon slime. So everybody count down with us for five, four, three, two, one, slime! You look like a giant booger. You look like a giant booger. You look like a giant booger. <laughs> Though red hot lost, I look back on that day fondly. I had a good time at the obstacle course, and I made friends that I'm sure will last a lifetime. And just being on that stage was an honor. I know one little boy who would have been very proud. Now, time to get all this pie out of my hair. Only you know what it's going to be, right here, on three. One, two, three, make the fire!